Good morning, good morning. Welcome to the Old Time Gospel Hour on Facebook Live Sunday morning program. Um, I had a little, I don't know what was going on, but um, I think everything is okay now. Um, good morning, good morning, good morning, Brother Samuel Rucker, Sister Olivia Rucker. Good morning, good morning. Sister Marcy Whitehead, Brother Edwin Whitehead, Sister Brenda Page, Sister Edna Randall Lane, Sister Ruth Minor, good morning, good morning. Good morning. It's trying to start off a challenge this morning. But uh, we're going to get through it. Good morning, Sister Bernice Cruz. Brother Robert Thomas, good morning. Good morning. Sister Denise Minor, Brother Willie. Sister Maudette Jefferson, good morning. Good morning. Granny May, good morning. Good morning. Brother Mark Evans, good morning. Sister Sandra Bush, Good morning. Happy birthday. Sister Christine Jones. Good morning. Ruthie, big sister, Ruthie Williams. Woo! Don't know what happened. But, uh, amen. We back up and going. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Little cousin Tinoya Gayfield. Sister Patricia Graham, Brother Danny Staniford. Good morning. I don't know what happened. Uh, yep, I don't know what happened this morning, but... Uh, I had to go out and come back in. Sister Patricia Graham. Sister Valerie Braxton, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Today is trying to start off being a challenge already, but uh, we're not going to uh, let that hinder us. Brother Byron West, Sister Sandra McAllister. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. Sister Marilyn, Sister Sean Stuckey, good morning. Good morning. Sister Vanessa Payne, good morning. Sister Viola Lumpkins, Miss Sweets. How you doing, Miss Sweets? Okay, with her sister, Sister Pauletta Lumpkins. Good morning, good morning. Good morning. Good 
Give Me a Clean Heart, and that was the adult choir at Circle of Light, and uh, I've got to tell it, I'll tell it everywhere I go, Junior Intermediate Choir at Rising Star, and I do not have the name of the young brother that was leading that song. I think that was back a little while ago, but um, if somebody knows who he is, please let me know. Good morning, good morning. We had a little rough start this morning. I don't know what was going on um, with Facebook, but uh, okay, we, we, we've we got everything back and up and we've got it going. Amen. Sister Bridget Silas, good morning, good morning. Because and Diane Adams, Big Cousin Alice Gayfield, good morning. Brother Ron and Sister Brenda McGee, good morning, good morning. Sister Janice Hawthorne Griffin, good morning.
Laura Clark, good morning. Brother Maurice and Sister Florence Lawrence, good morning. Good morning. Brother Melvin Evans, good morning.
He's so good. God is so good. I just can't tell it all. Amen. The Junior Intermediate Choir, Circle of Light, with Brother Gerald Johnson and Brother Keith Laney leading. Amen. Amen. Circle of Light. Amen. Good morning, Sister Geraldine uh, Coleman. Good morning, Brother Otis West. Good morning, good morning, Sister Freddie Logan, uh, Brother Walter, Sister Audrey Griffin, good morning, Sister Stacy Honey, good morning, Brother Pete Cotton, Sister Christine Brew, good morning, good morning, also YouTube listeners out there, all of our YouTube listeners, good morning, good morning, also Sister Gloria Arrington, the Sister Pudding. Sylvester, Williva, and Annie Rice, my cousins in Mississippi, Brother Brian and Sister Vanessa Tate, Brother Terrell Lane, Brother Robert and Sister Gail Buchanan, Sister Juanice Mays, Brother Tony, Sister Vanessa Fitzpatrick, Sister Theon Jones, good morning, good morning. Good morning, Sister Taylor Lawrence, good morning, little sister. Oh, also, this is our uh, first Sunday, so we will have a sermon this morning in, in a few minutes.
Sister Bertha Bradley leading at Rising Star. Amen, amen. Back in the day, back in the day music. Deborah Long, good morning. Oh. 
Amen. Amen. So you would know how many times, how many times has the Lord blessed us and done so much for us. Amen. Amen. I love this song. Amen. That was uh, the Inspirational Choir with Mother Phyllis Johnson leading at Circle of Light. Amen. Amen. Okay, uh, I'm going to uh, read the announcements here, and uh, then we're going to get into our um, our sermon. Amen. Amen. Um, first, thank you so much for your donations to this program. They are greatly appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthdays going out today, November the 7th. Sister Sandra Bush, happy birthday, happy birthday. Tomorrow, Monday, November the 8th, uh, my little cousin, uh, Serenity Bria, uh, Sister Esther Chairs Mitchell, and my little cousin in Alabama, Tina Sanders Mitchell, Mitchell. Uh, Tuesday, November the 9th, my uh, brother-in-law, uh, Joe Thompson, his birthday. Wednesday, November the 10th, Brother Robert Moore and Brother Marcus Fountain. Thursday, November the 11th, Sister Michelle Randall. And Sunday, next Sunday, November the 12th, Sister Florence Lawrence and Sister Lanasia Johnson. Amen. We're sending prayers out to Sister Rebecca Griffin, Brother Walter, Sister Audrey Griffin, Sister Regina Laddier, Sister Marilyn Stuckey, Brother Edwin Whitehead, Sister Marjorie Hutchinson, to my boo-boo, Brother Willie Robinson, Sister Lula Mae Robinson, Brother Alfred Pickens, Sister Chanel Miles, Brother Pete Williams, Omar Chavez, Vivian Daly, Lula Adams, uh, Brandon Taylor, Maurice Washington, Monica Cleveland, all of the sick and confined and the homeless, frontline workers, COVID and Delta patients, and especially going out to the bereaved families. Also, we're praying for each other and this whole world. Amen. Uh, we uh, found out that Sister Pauletta King passed and funeral arrangements are incomplete at this time. If you need legal help, call Legal Services of Eastern Missouri, 314-361-8834 or the Eviction Hotline, 314-534-4200. If you're behind on your rent and you would like to schedule a mediation between your landlord and yourself, call St. Louis City Resolution Center, 314-255-7440. St. Louis County Mediation Project, 314-833-0226. Also, we have a house content sale uh, for Brother Ani McKinney. The address 8792 Darnell Place, Jennings, Missouri, 63136. And this will be Saturday, November the 13th, 2021. From 8 a.m. to 1 p.m., best offers are accepted. And as always, thank you for sharing the program and let others hear this good gospel music. And uh, some of our back in the day, a lot of our back in the day music. So thank you. Thank you so much for sharing. And uh, also uh, let others that are not on Facebook, not to worry, they can go to YouTube the Old Time Gospel Hour on FB Live. And they can uh, still see the program. So if if they're not on Facebook, they can still go to YouTube and pull up 
the uh, Old Time Gospel Hour on Facebook Live and see recorded programs. And uh, still, if anyone would like to talk on the program after the uh, Sunday evening programs or either the Wednesday evening programs, please let me know so that I can get you on to uh, so that you can talk. Amen. All right. Well, we're getting ready to uh, go into our hymn and then into our sermon. And during this time, I will not talk. So we're getting ready to get started. And that was the late Reverend Lloyd G. Robinson. Amen. Because Reed didn't do what I want him to do. I'm going to get God to kill him. It ain't did like that. <laughs> we had a picture here one time. <laughs> uh, 
The law. See, sometimes you need to turn, most times, them dreams you have to you. Because a lot of times, it's you. This preacher, uh, still up here, on a Sunday morning, told us, the Lord going to do something to you all. Because you all won't recognize me. This is really thing. You won't recognize me like you do, Brother Son. And like you did, Reverend Glover. And the Lord go do something because he showed me. A tornado rose. And y'all ain't for done for that. And touched down. And the only way you all were saved, I was running, begging money. And that saved you all. I got up and told him, I said, that ain't going to happen, Reverend. God ain't going to do nothing to us. I said, it might be you. Didn't it happen? Yeah, and I think you predict for somebody else. Listen, God ain't going to pull nothing here uh, that I don't know about. That was before I even got up here. So, I mean, God ain't going to do nothing else. Not these people. No, no. Then you better watch. It might be you. <laughs> you can talk a lot of stuff. You ought to be careful how you talk with nothing to back it up with. You ought to be mindful how you talk. You ought to be mindful who you're talking about. Because you've got to give a counter in journey. You better mind. Amen. So the other told him, sir, he said, now here's, I know what to do. But you all go ahead and pray. And next week, let me know what you have. Some saw so and so. Some saw themselves. Some saw, you know it. Some saw. He said, go back and come back again. But I know what to do. Amen. And we went on like that and went on like that. And finally, uh, listen, the preacher desires, folks, will come to pass. And there ain't nothing you can do about it. He said, I know what to do. And uh, nobody knew what he was talking about but him. But that's one time that I disobeyed him. Because he told us to pray for a chairman. I never did ask God nothing about that. I disobeyed him. I never did. And God never did show me it was going to be me. Not then. So, uh, through the preacher's desire, God, uh, for some unknown reason, made me leave National League. And I was doing all right down there. And moved on to Mount Sinai. And I didn't tell him I was moving, and didn't tell him I had moved. And some days later, he heard about it. He told Brother said, I heard that you all got old man's son over there with you. And now we can get done what we want done. See what I'm talking about? Oh, man. You can't be judged. So now we can get the Pokemon. Now, he wasn't talking to me. He's talking to somebody else. I still don't know nothing about it. I said, man, don't, you don't have to push for nothing. You don't have to buck for nothing. If God has got something for you, can't nobody keep you out. You don't have to try to push your way in. I read a scripture that says, better to be asked up than to be asked down. So, uh, one night, I was working from 4 to 12, thinking about nothing, about the church. 
and knowing that. Brother Reed was working day shift. At that time, we was having board meetings and church meetings. I was out for lunch. I looked up, and here he come stepping down the step. I was sitting over there by myself. I always stayed by myself. I ain't never been found wrapped up around a bunch of people, unless it was at a dance or at church. Uh, he came over. All everybody was out in the, in the basement sitting down. I was over by myself. So he came up. Go ahead and take it. Oh, Lord. So that's it. Reverend said, if I can get one man to stand still and let you know you got to have some help. Right. What about God? Don't say this. God, send somebody to help you, but he'll get somebody. You don't have to beg nobody. Oh, this is, I'm, I'm going down the line now. This is how we got where we at, men. Are you all listening? This is why we are up here this morning. Some of these things you need to know. Uh, to keep this a history. And teach it to your children. And your children's children. And the unborn generation. Every time why you are being able to shout here, somebody, before your death, somebody. Somebody went without. Somebody shared the many tears. For you to get up here and flesh your wings. And think you're going somewhere. And you're going to take over. Nobody will never take this over. Because the Holy Ghost said it. It'll take you over. Oh, how much. All that he didn't finish, I'm finished. This is a dangerous spot of ground. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, I'm setting it. I mean, we ain't worried about hollering and preaching. I want to get the truth on Stand when the world's on fire. That man named Reverend Chairman God. Better known as God's man. Better still sit direct from God. That was a man named Chairman. Whose name was Shem? Sent from God. I know it's not. Did not know it for sure. I'm here. What you talking about? Who you gonna spread? You is gonna spread. You gonna spread in the ground? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. If I can give me one man, stand still, I'll bring the church. So I'll pull the gun. Oh, son, if I can get him straight, I can depend on him. Won't nobody swing him. Pippa, do you know that right? Even now. Do you know it or you believe it? <laughs> no. From nowhere will have me to bury from this coast the best of my ability and the best of my understanding. The white come. Who come with you? This ain't what you want to hear, but this is what I want to tell you today. You ain't got nothing to do with your being here. You just one more in the number. 
The Spirit put it here. Peace brought us here. Not confusion. And we will not tolerate none of it. Lord, I'd rather like to go. Turn on the outside and peep in. Now tarnish this place with evil. Y'all listening? In the time you hit this flow, from here in, I want you to speak with peace. I don't care who you are. You ain't got some peace in you. Don't get up here. And don't get down there. And don't get up out there. And don't get up over there. Two I'm going to skin you. This ain't no junk place. You don't want no junk up in here. This is a place where people be born again. This is where lives get straightened out. When I get on the wrong track, I come in here and get straight. Then you go mess it up. Ah, oh, how much that? Now, I ain't talking about no with nobody. I'm talking about this is going for the whole business. There ain't no certain group or no certain people. This goes from the pulpit to the door, from wall to wall, end to end. And I'm saying it for, and I'm saying it with authority. I'm aiming for this to remain, remain, even when I'm gone. I'm not taking my time. I want to plant it in you. Listen, without the Spirit, we ain't got nothing. See, how many thousand folks in here? We ain't got no Spirit, we ain't got nothing. Hear how you can preach and how you can sing, how you can pray. If it ain't no spirit, you ain't got nothing. Here's what we're going to do. We're going back to the old path. Jeremiah said, get in the way. How much? And uh, seek for the old path. And when you find it, walk there in. That's where we're going What is the old path? I heard somebody say, I am the way, the truth, and the light. Wait a minute. I would be a man. Come in by the truth. Come in by love. Come in by peace. Come in by justice. Oh, how much? About two now, Joe. I don't want nobody to shout. I want you to listen. Whether you believe it or not, I'm setting your doom today. I come out for that. Whether you believe it or not, you will never stumble over this. And I ain't mad with nobody. I'm just laying this bridge down here like I know it. Not like I believe it, like I know it. Only brought us here. Understanding brought us here. Meditating to God brought us here. Something, human suffering I'm talking about, brought us here. Money didn't bring us here. Smartness didn't bring us here. Education didn't bring us here. Amen. 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 Is you listening? 
Are you enjoying it? If you can, can you stand it? If you can't rub with it. If you can't stand it, lay it out. Because I'm still coming. Oh yeah, I know what I'm talking about. I was forced to know. Only way you can know God. You made to know Him. You don't read to know God. You don't pray to know God. You suffer to know God. Oh, how much. Yeah, the only way David was able to tell that man that I'll take it. Take his experience on what he had went through, not what he read. I'll take it. Yes, why? Not because I'm David. Not because he's after you. But he's trying to defile the army of a living God. That's when I'm going to kill him. That's when I'm going to kill you. If you try to mess up the church. <laughs> you trying to erase what the Holy Ghost through my daddy set up. And you trying to erase it. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to say ashes to ashes. Now that's tough, ain't it? Well, y'all let the truth alone, then. Don't try to tarnish the truth with some junk. As a man, you were born again down there. Oh, by him, the truth. By obeying a man. Look up. Call along. Oh, how much? How's I come with you? Yeah? Tell him, I said so. That's how come we're here. Do like I tell you. Don't come out, bring you back here. That's how come we're here. And we were blundering in the dark. Couldn't find our way. Looked like all hope was gone. But God, by himself, told somebody to tell me there's a man over there. Give him sight to everybody. Oh, how much? Oh, yes, he did. Yes, he did. Oh, yes, he did. But my way was so dark that I couldn't see. Oh, how much? But I heard somebody say Go down on Second Street. Oh, how much? You don't have to go along with me. I'll tell you by myself. He sent me to preach. He didn't say you were going to help me. He told me to preach it, and I'll be with you. Always, even to the end of the world. How much? You need to pray for me. I'll make it by myself. Mm, you may not feel like praying. Oh, how much? You need to say man. If you don't want to, I'll make it anyhow. Let all men be alive, but my word will stand forever. This place here is planted and found its own God word. And I happen to be a member. Oh, I'm glad about it. I happen to be a member when it was founded here and the preacher my sin. He invited me to come in behind. Oh, how much? Now, I didn't say how far behind, as long as I was behind. And since he was able to do that, I've been able to invite a lot of you in. Well, we ought to respect the children. Oh, how much? Not all of we going. How about that, brother? We ought to say, you're going. But you can't help me keep nothing in here with good as 
sport good art. You know so much and doing nothing, sport good art. You ought to shut up. And you won't stand for nothing, you ought to shut up. God can't eat you, and I can't eat you. Oh, how much. You ought to stand if you have to stand by yourself. Before you hurt, you ought to cry. That's right, this is the way of the church. Before you hurt somebody, you'd rather share it to you. You'd rather hurt yourself. You'd rather be hurt, be hurt and the hurt. That's the way of the church. You wouldn't bring up nothing to bring confusion in here. Oh, how mercy. Not only in here, at your house either. On the job. Why? Because I'm a member of the church. All right. Um, that's the end of the sermon. That is all that I have of this sermon. Amen. Amen. It sounded like it was just getting good and that's the end. Um this is the uh this is also the end of the program this morning. We had a little rough start getting off. Uh I don't know what was going on with uh with Facebook. Um but uh thank God that it straightened out um so that um uh, I could get this message out this morning uh tune in again this evening at 5 30 p.m for uh some more good gospel um some good gospel music this evening yes i i was really enjoying that too i wish i had the uh i wish i had the whole sermon of that but um Unfortunately, that is all that I have at this time. But you never know. Somebody may uh, run across the whole sermon and uh, share it with us. Amen. Amen. So tune in again this evening at 5.30 p.m. And um, thank you so much for listening in. And hopefully this evening... We won't have the problems that we had this morning. So thank you so much uh, for listening in and God bless.